Hello and welcome to another Mario Maker Super World. It's been a really long time since I've played a Super World. I almost forgot what Super Worlds are all about. But this is Super MM's WOM. I would love to know what that stands for. Um, the creator of this world did reach out to me in the comments, asked me to check it out. Um, so that's what we're going to do over the next couple of weeks. Um, but if you are watching this, Mr. Creator, please let me know what that stands for. I would love to know. This is a bit of a shorter experience. It's going to be six worlds, 30 levels, and I believe it's all in the 3D world style. So we're going to check out world one in this video. We're going to see how it goes. Starting with pipe playground, grab at least three 10 coins. This feels very like a typical first level of a Mario game kind of feel. Very nice. Extra life, I'll take that. Thank you very much. What's in the pipe? Lots and lots of coins. I think it's getting to about time where I'm gonna switch out. Oh, I can't leave through that pipe. Okay, we're heading back. Um, yeah, I think we're getting to the point where I think it's gonna be time to switch away from Luigi soon. Feeling a little Luigi'd out at this point, even though it is the year of Luigi, and I've stuck to that for almost the whole year, but... I don't know, might be time for somebody new. Maybe some Toadette action. I don't know, who knows? Maybe that can be a, a membership perk. <laughs> Choose who I play as in Mario Maker. God dang it. Nice. That worked out nicely. Yeah, if you haven't watched my video, I think it was during my Mario Maker Halloween uh, level, my Mario Monday Halloween, I should say, that I played. Um, I totally forgot there was a clear condition till just now. Um, but I was talking about um, creating memberships on YouTube and some of the perks that I could include. Um, so if you have any suggestions at all, please let me know in the comments. I brought up a few sort of suggestions in that video, but yeah, let me know if you have any ideas. It was a pretty good opening start. Nice and casual. I think I'll be okay where I won't need any of the mushroom houses. We'll see if that bites me in the butt further down, but we'll see how it goes. Meow Meow Meadows reach the goal as Cat Mario. Dang it, there's no Meow Meow in there? Oh, there we go. There's a Meow Meow. Guess I'll grab the 10 coin while I'm here. Check the trees as well. I always forget the Cat... Mario mechanics, like sort of like the the pouncing and stuff like that. There we go. Oh god, that was close. Ta-da! Guess I could have gone for that 10 coin, but eh, that's okay. Alright, we're getting our vertical climb on here. Missed another 10 coin. Ah, oh, we need that to get across. I was like, why are we just hitting random blocks? But that makes sense. Wait, is that going to be a soft lock? 
Oh no, I could just ground pound it. Can I not? If I were to make a mistake? Yeah, I could just ground pound that. Okay, never mind. I don't know why this is so difficult for me to figure out, but... There we go. Holy jeez. Major brain farts there. If I were a soldier, that would be my that would be my soldier name. Major brain farts reporting for duty. Ooh, what do we have over here? Coins? All right, fair enough. There we go. Two levels successfully completed. This again was another pretty good level. Not too easy. Not too difficult. Good stuff. Alright, level 3. We are entering the Goomba Realm. Goomba Gauntlet Mystery Box. Defeat all three Goombas. I am yet to see a Goomba. Where are they hiding? There's one. There's two. What is this for? Is that necessary? I don't know what that box is for. You guys aren't Goombas, you're pretenders. Hopefully I only needed the one key. Uh, okay, what are we doing here? Guess I'll go this way. Nope, that's not it. Where's the key at? There it is. There's the last Goomba! Am I supposed to use that to squish him, or what? I don't understand. Oh, no, wait, I do understand. But we'll come back to that. <laughs> there we go. That's what we were supposed to do. We got it all figured out. Now we can run to the finish line. There we go. This is a, a neat little level, it's a neat little diversion. I like the sort of puzzly elements, especially with that last Goomba. Good stuff. Alright, we have a Koopa up next on the map. I assume it's going to be a Koopa level. Koopa Karting 101, reach the goal in a Koopa car. I also like that each level has a clear condition, that they really fit the sort of themes very well. It's very nice. God dang it. There's my Koopa car. Nice. Oh, that's it? Okay, fair enough. Kind of wish that level was a bit longer. I kind of like using the Koopa cart. I feel like there could have been a little bit more, but still pretty well done. Alright, here we go. The Castle of World 1. Bowser's Lava Lick Castle. Defeat 
all of the one Meowzers. I pray that there's no Meowzer RNG in this. There we go. Get rid of him. Grab myself a cat suit. That just circles around there. Get rid of those guys. Easy enough. Yeah, yeah. Dang it. You cost me my cat suit, good sir. I was not expecting that to go under. <laughs> Uh, do I need to take this with me? I'm gonna say yes, but I'm not sure. I can use it to defeat the Meowser, probably. <laughs> there we go. I don't know what it was that I did that killed him, but I'll take it. Oops. Yeah, let me grab these coins. Good enough. We're almost- we're close to another extra life. And that's the end! Wonder if this block's gonna go up this time. Okay, good. There we go. Yeah, not a bad castle level as well. Some cool elements there. Meowzer in World 1. Not too shabby, easy enough to beat. Overall, I'm digging this world so far. It's a nice, fast-paced world, some cool elements throughout. Really well done. Anyways, that's going to do it for this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure you leave a like, leave a comment, and consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. We're going to check out World 2 next time, but until then, have a good one, and I'll talk to you later. Music